Hey fam, welcome back. And if you're new, welcome. My name is Nye. And in this video, we're going to talk about part two of AI in Adobe Lightroom called Denoise. Also, if you haven't seen my last video, we talked about masking in part one. I'll make sure to put the link below so you can watch it after this video. Not wasting any more of your time. Let's talk about Denoise. First, make sure you're on the develop tab. Literally the hardest part. So on the right side, where all your editing options are, you'll want to scroll down until you see noise reduction. Right below it, you see denoise. Click on the button, and then you'll be prompted with a pop-up window with the amount. In my experience, 50 to 55% would be good enough, and just click enhance. After that, you just have to wait for the program to do its magic. Anything more than 55%, the people starts to look very plasticky, I guess. I'm not even sure if that's a word. Um, but yeah, before and after. Why is this important? Well, if you're like me, if you shoot without a flash and in uncontrolled environment, you introduce noise in your images. Unless you're going for that retro vintage look, grain can distract from the image. And now with one click, your image can look very different. It's such a time saver in my opinion. Comment below what you think of the new denoise feature and if you find these types of video helpful. Consider hitting that subscribe button and turn on notification bell so you know when I drop a new video. Please help me as I march along on my road to 1000 subscribers. Feel free to share the channel. It doesn't cost you anything and it helps me out a lot with the YouTube gods. And in part 3, I'll talk about lens blur. Thanks fam. I appreciate each and every one of you and I'll see you on the next one.